Hello guys, alright. Um, I am going to show you how to make your Android phone faster without any root required. And this is on my LG G3. I'm recording using Mobizen. Now, I'm going to show you the first step. First step is you go to settings and then go to general and then you go down all to the bottom or until you find a thing called about phone now um on samsung's if you tap the build number seven times or more um you can unlock a thing called developer options it might be different on different phones i actually forgot how i got it on my lg g3 but anyways, you go to developer options once you get it and say okay to the warning. Have developer options on as it shows in the top, top right. And you go down to do, 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 uh, drawing right here and window animation scale. Transition animation scale animation duration scale now animator duration scale um You want all of these at the same one You can either have them all at 0.5 or off or one or any of these okay Now I have All of these at 10 right now you see how it takes really slow to transition to stuff? You don't want that. Most phones usually are at 1 or 1.5. You either want to turn yours to 0.5 or off. If it's off, it'll act really robotic, but you can't send likes in Messenger apparently. And if you have 0.5, that's what most people like to use. It's much faster than uh, one times for the animation scale and blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah. But I have it at uh, animation is off because I can still like send likes by just getting the emoji in Messenger. And do, 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 do. There's another one. Yeah, you have to go down to hardware accelerated rendering, which is just below this window animation, transition animation, and animator duration scales. Whole thing. And uh, go to force GPU rendering, and it says use 2D hardware acceleration in applications. Um. I like to use it. It helps um, all my apps be much more uh, faster and they lag a lot less. So this is very recommended. Helps a lot with Asphalt 8 for some weird reason, even though it is a 3D game. Step two. Now, this is the part where you wanna get apps. You can either get Greenify, which doesn't really help for me. You can get um, DU and optimize. Um, this helps optimize your phone so it's much faster. Um, so it optimizes the battery by cleaning up power consumption apps and high CPU usage apps. And it's great if you have say like an LG G3 that uh, you use the CPU. Like you do the whole like thing where you go to, uh, sorry about this. Uh, you go to phone cooler and it'll find like the apps that are heating your phone. And since LG G3s tend to heat up a lot, it's really good to use this. And if it says like 42 degrees Celsius, you know you have a really hot phone. Yeah. Now, let's 
go to uh, RAM Cleanup. This is my favorite app. Um, Asphalt 8 and tons of other uh, apps that I have, uh, they use a lot of RAM. And the more RAM you have available, the smoother everything on your phone will be. So you just tap it, get tap the RAM cleanup thing, and yeah, it'll just clean up all your RAM. At least it says it does that, and it does. Come on, keep doing it. Keep doing it. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, okay. And let's just get yeah, tap. Okay. All right. Um, other than doing those steps and stuff, and uh, like um, cleaning storage and stuff, um, that's basically all you can do to uh, have your phone be much faster on Android without any root required. All right. Peace out.